So, um, just recently in the UK, uh, IKEA have released their own smart lighting um, bulbs and equipment. Um, and I thought this was really interesting. Um, and I just thought I'd just have a quick look at the website so, to see what they've got. Um, first of all, first thing that, that leaps out to me on the screen is this name. How do you pronounce that? Tradfree? Tradfry? I'm not sure. It's the IKEA way, just go with it. Um, but let's have a look. So, choose a light for early mornings, another for late evenings, and a third for cooking or working at home. Dim, turn stuff off turn it on and switch from warm to cold using a remote control or app the smart lighting range is plug and play meaning there's no need for new wiring or hiring electrician i like in the sound of that so let's have a quick look at the different products so uh, here we've got the motion sensor kit which is a light bulb with a motion sensor uh, a dimming kit uh, so some kind of button or switch again with a bulb this is another dimming switch it looks a bit more advanced and then here you've got a trad fry app and gateway and with this you can dim and adjust the color temperature create preset moods and timers and control everything from your mobile or tablet now from reading that what i'm thinking is so for these three here where you just come with the, the switching or switches or motion sensors I'm not sure if you're going to be able to control them with an app, but however, this one looks like you definitely can. Um, and you get a, a bit of a glimpse of the, the app there. So let's take a bit of a closer look. So let's look at one of these uh, dimming kits. So that looks like I can't work out whether that's a switch you just click on or you rotate or, or both. Uh, obviously there's the bulb looks fairly similar to the Philips Hue bulb and there oh actually yeah it looks like you rotate it as if st stuck that onto the side of a lamp you rotate that um, to set the, the brightness of the bulb so quite nice and you know with Ikea they, they do make quality products um, so you know if, if you're buying this it's going to be um, you know it's going to last a while it's going to be good um, but also look at the prices 15 pound for the dimming switch one uh for this more advanced one 29 pound so you said this has got your your on button looks like this might be well it's like left and right i'm not sure what that is because here is it looks like you're bright and low so you've got your dimming switches on there uh, but tw yeah 29 pound for that let's see what else do you do um motion sensor kit so yeah with this you just be able to put it in your hallway or, or whatever room you want and when motion is detected um it will turn on or off um and i do know this has got a day and a night mode so um in the daytime you can just have it i don't know ignore motion and then at night time when you need the light to come on um you can have that come on as well you can buy the switches separate, you can buy the gateway separate for £25. Uh, well it's, it's quite big from the looks of it here. Um, so, but it says with the Trad Fry, Trad Free gateway and app, you can control each light source individually. Ah, so maybe it just lets you group your bulbs together and to control them that way. Uh, this is pretty cool. Oh, hang on, nine pound one. <coughs> so if you just want to buy the bulb on its own, nine pound bargain, well worth it. Uh, LED bulb, GU10, real life X don't do these yet. I don't know why. Frustrating Philips shoes do. Uh, here you can get those uh, the E14 bulbs, which I think people call them candle screwers or something like that. The really thin ones. Um, uh well led light panel let's have a look at this okay so you can put it on your ceiling or on a wall by the looks of it looks like you do have to run a cable to it oh you can even arrange something in, in um, a kind of array of lights that's quite cool uh door 
a door one so this looks similar people are sticking it to doors oh that's pretty cool in that furniture lighting that up yeah and it shows you there it's actually it's not a okay so it is the door it's not something you stick near the door it is the door that's pretty sweet and again that must be a door for a different uh, piece of furniture you can buy from Ikea um, yeah so I'm hoping to get my hands on some of this soon to try out make a video on um, so I can show it for you um, I think it's really cool and especially when you look at the price um, it's well worth uh, you know just getting a ball trying it out um, and hopefully I'll be doing that soon and I'll do a video um, for you when I do thank you